Oh yo you lucky people. It's Game on Game Rare. Welcome back to Wizardry 8. Oh we've got a fucking group of enemies coming up this corridor. Um well, I haven't played in a few days because I'm sure you realise I was getting more than a little frustrated with the riffs. So I took a few days off. I feel much better now. I don't mind getting frustrated with the game, it's just make silly mistakes. Uh I did forget to level up at the end of the last video, so we'll We'll make a change and we'll start this video with the level ups, I suppose. Because I just wanted to get out of there, so I just exited. Completely forgot. Alright, um, what are you doing at the minute? You're tanking at the minute, aren't you? So, what are you tanking with? Your weapons, so yeah, dexterity. See? Nearly made a mistake straight off. They're having a great start. Uh, I don't really care. That's the thing right now, is I don't care. You're not an important character to me. Uh, we'll get you Superman. Might want a buff at some point. Um, yeah, we'll keep whacking on the sword for now. This is a good sort of test to see if I'd use these people in the future with the small problem of it'd be a better test if they didn't start you know at level 10, 15, whatever whenever you recruit them with skills that aren't how I would expect them in the first place because although yeah, you might say the game will know better than me but perhaps I wanted to deliberately spec them badly because I'm a bad player and I should suffer for that not have the game try and fix it for me because that would make the game much more interesting Right, now the people we care about. Let's do TB first. Hello TB, haven't seen you in a while mate, how are you doing? Let's um... Vitality. Because you do occasionally get in a melee fight. And let's go with... Will we just strength for your stamina while we TB? I think we were, aren't we? Although we do need sensors. It's wild, so it increases mental resistance. Um... I'm going to go sensors. But it's be finished in a couple of levels anyway. Although, it's a master of loots. I don't think I've ever had that one before. Um, well, you can tell who my best play party members have been, because they're the ones who pretty much can't do anything now on the level ups. We'll give you sword, we'll give you shield. And we'll give you... Another way you can learn power cast. I'll give you bow as well, why not? Bishop? Hello, Bishop. I'm really too. Because she can learn like, everything in the game. I really want to bring all the stats up just so she can be everything as well. Right, um. Yeah, we were stacking sensors with you, aren't we? Because if there's someone you don't want to go insane, it's your main healer. And your secondary main DPS. Maybe I'm a bit too dependent on Bishop and Tinkton. Yeah, haven't failed the game yet. That should be interesting with one, once I mod it though, because that um, sort of changes that balance a little bit. Not a stupid amount, but a little bit. Uh, you see, that's a lot of spells that I quite want. I ain't got fallen stars of anyone yet. What is it? It's um, say just a long AoE, so it's the same as Nuclear Blast and that just hits everything on the screen basically. Um, causing painful wounds. You see, now normally I think that was just damage based, but that might actually cause bleed or something, I have no idea. Painful wounds sounds like a debuff, do not But we're going to take 4 stars anyway, because it's like a spell that no one else has got, so. Uh, yeah, Alchemy and Psionics. Not really a lot I can do with Bishop. Uh, range combat, I suppose. Just don't use it very often, but. And Tinkton. Oh, buddy, old pal, what can you be? <laughs> All the spellcasters and a rogue. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, um. Well, we're going to at least put one point in vitality because we're going to max that next turn. Because, you know, it's an important stat for a spellcaster, extra health. So it shouldn't be in any way safe in the middle of the in the group. 
in the middle of the formation and senses for a bit of mentality resistance. But you have two choices, but no spells actually one. I'm sure you learn something more useful soon. I, I'm pretty sure there's like another group of spells a maze can learn, but it's just the fact that all his stats are pretty much full. You know, what's the lowest of these two? 266, 264. Alright, we're going to take Town Coat. Keep one of the points. See, because we can't level these up anymore. And, you know, if it was relative to his level, we really can't get him. Skill level, anyway. Actual level, maybe. Because you could reach 25. You reach higher than that if you do everything in the game. But that's like, um. Always reminds me of Fallout New Vegas, that does. There's a perk you can take. Well, you can take it any time you level up, I think, but. On uh, like the first when you first select new perks in there, and it's like you you can uh, you never become addicted to drugs or other stimulants. But if you go over, you can't pass level thirty either. Once you reach level thirty, your experience stops. And I think I completed that game twice. Never on hardcore. I really should do that at some point. But I think I completed that game twice. Not completely completed. I didn't have all the DLC. Good old Xbox 360 rather than. PC. I've got it on PC now, all the DLC. Uh, I disarmed this, right? Yeah. Okay. I don't remember this place too well. Something. Look over there. What could that be? But yeah, my point with Fallout. I always do that. Was um, I think I completed the game two, maybe three times in all, to get all the different engines and stuff, because I was stupid and didn't think about just you know, save cheating it. Save for it and just loading it to get different endings, which would have made more sense. Bodies over here now. Okay, so what are you guys? Priestesses, priestesses. Um, I don't particularly want to fight you. I'm gonna have to, but uh, should we start it from? We don't really want to start it from here because these are all long range bloody idiots, and they. So we want to get closer before we initiate the fight. I can start the fight and then run up, but that will waste my turn. So. Yes. I'm going to do it the old fashioned way. Save my mana. Oh, for fuck's sake. So yeah. I saw the trap off wall inspecting it. I don't think I've ever done that before. And now no one has any mana. Ready. Jesus Christ, how much is that? Is that me or I don't know what that? Uh, well, I don't like the fact that I'm now really low on mana. Oh, Something stirs. Be on guard. Come okay. Okay. Care of. Stop swearing, Lee, and why more about dealing with these assholes who took all your mana away from you? Okay. So I spend the beginning of this point buffing up. We know how this sort of stuff goes. Soul shield. Samurai can use element shield for me. No, he can't because he's lost all that mana. <laughs> okay. Um, I did camp, obviously. It shall be so. Since the last part. I remember doing it before I saved the game and turned it off. Um, so he couldn't cast element shield, could he? She can, but she can also cast a lot of other stuff. I want to see this anyway. I want to see the animation, so we're going to cast that. Um, you can cast element shield anyway, can't you? Yeah. Right Alright, full power element shield from you. Um, TV, since you've already hasted people, can you use. Um, I'll try and get one of them, I suppose. No, they're out of range. Okay, we won't be using that. Let's use Bouncy Hell. No, that's the wrong one. Chaos Drone. Let's use Awesome. Alright, Ranger. I assume you did Toxic Cloud, it probably landed. <laughs> Alright, can you use Acid Bomb please, since we haven't got no holy mana left? Because you know, that man okay. any magic trap was a dick. <laughs> Obviously if I'd used my spells, I could have probably done that about getting it propped, but I didn't... I assumed 87%, I didn't know you could activate a trap before you worked out what it was. And, um, oh, I, I can't even remember who I summoned that elemental whip, so let's not do that. Uh, well, you can cast Firestorm, Tinkton. I know it's not going to do a lot to wrap axe, but you can cast Firestorm anyway. <laughs> It'd have been a better animation if there weren't a ceiling blocking Arthur, I suppose. I'll have a look outside. 
Right, um... Do you want to cast Might to Magic? Yeah, that one. It's going to kill all your holy mana, but it will restore someone's mana, so... Right, and then we are going to... Run out of them. That's something for eight, so I'm saying. These are not going to be anywhere near as hard as them two fights I had to go through at the hallway, so... Even if there's more enemies up there. You first, I guess. Thanks for volunteering. Doesn't matter if you're silenced, you still keep the crap out from Saber. Yep, because that's like going to be one damage a turn or something. Acid Bomb will be more than that. Acid Bomb will be. I'm not sure exactly how much because they all come up at the same time, but they, they add up. A group of debuffs do like at least 50 damage around. Debuffs or dots, you know, even. Because, you know, I remember saying once before they were saying to do the same thing. Oh, also, yeah, I've got no bloody buffs anymore either. But yeah, I remember saying before that debuffs and dots were essentially the same thing. Of course they're not. I was just half asleep, I reckon. A dot is damage over time. A debuff is, say, reduced armor class or reduced attack pack. You know, something that reduces stats or ability. Not necessarily stats, it might just be, you know, your controls are reversed, there's still a debuff. No more animal, I'm coming. I'm here to save the day. Obviously with no magic on and no bar, so I just gotta walk up to him and hit him all. That's my main plan here. I'm probably not gonna die, these do like no damage, they're just stats effects. They just try and silence you and insane you and shit like that. I'm pretty sure I usually have bio me when I do this, but then I probably don't do the um, peace mission because I usually kill one of the armies. So I probably don't have these two with me. Are we all, all quite finished, yeah? I know I could probably do a bit more, I could probably do this a bit faster by actually casting spells. I suppose I'll set up a couple for the weak people. Yeah, an oxygen fumes for you. Just because that's one of the very few stats you have maxed. I'll try and get a point in that. I apologise if I'm any more difficult to understand today. I was at the dentist earlier, my mouth's still in the healing process. So I imagine my lisp is getting indecipherable. That's like the most scary thing they do, and it'll take them forever to kill me with that. Oh, you're a high priestess. Nothing particularly scary about you, except that you've got a sword, apparently. It actually looks more like a saber than a sword. It actually looks... Oh, no, it's a... Because it looks more like a pool cue or snooker cue. But actually, it's a... Um, Called double bladed staff. I need to call it double bladed lightsaber. I know it's flaming. But it is essentially just a flaming staff. Or pole arm. Well, I imagine she'll drop it, so we'll find out. Uh huh. I'm going to win this with just melee attacks. I suppose I could rehaste. That would uh, make this go a lot faster. Taken care of. Say, have anything I can shoot right there? Nope. No, I don't. Anyway. Just cast spells with them guys. Just, you know, to do something. Did I say acid bomb? No, I didn't. Well, I did, but I didn't mean to. Uh, yeah, blood and blood. I'll do like. You want to aim over there? Sure. <laughs> Don't always, not sure what you're looking at, but sure. I know she's fire. Boy and Blood's going to do like nothing to her, but um, he's got no arrows. I don't think he's going to need his inventory. Right, he's got 14 vipers. 
Uh, yeah, I'm gonna save them though. He's gonna need some allies. You know, if there's one percent chance if I get into a big fight. All right, it's a flame staff. Doesn't look like a staff. It looks like a spear or a, a Jordan saber sort of thing. But it's a nice staff. Seven to twenty-one, four hit, three initiative. That's very nice. Let's have a look at the. Uh, oh, hang on. Can't clear these debuffs. Uh, the stat increase. Debuffs. What the hell am I on about? Can't clear the stat increases because I had a box up on the screen. Uh, it's got 20% blind on it. Extended attack range. It probably is cursed. Stats like this, it more than likely is. Firestorm power 5. 18 charges on that. That's a pretty top class uh, staff. And I should imagine you, you'll be using it. There you go. And is it cursed? No, it's not. Even better. Although, not really long it matters because I can never have any ammunition to give him anymore anyway. Carrying lots of shit, but I'm not leaving this area just to come back, so. We will finish the area. We will suffer an encumbrance, but we will finish the damn area. <laughs> Stack of 39 strikes, yeah, you take them, mate. There you go, now he's got some. And 15 barbs. Sure, we'll give you them for later. Uh, Spirit of Death to the cursed one that drains your life. We're not equipping that. Alright, you've got no bullet, no stones. I don't think I've got any of this stuff. Uh, musket balls. No, no, I don't. Alright, you've got no ranged weapon to speak of. You've got some feather darts. Yeah, I use darts. Alright, um, what kind of bolts are they? Fear, lightnings. Alright, we'll give you these fear, stack that up, give you these lightnings for later. I know this is. I should have done this before I started recording. Oh, look, we've got some big stacks there. I must. Oh, I went. Of course, yeah. Hours is one of the things I actually stocked up on some extra because I was, you know, going to be away from a shop for a long time. I um. Well, you got your unlimited shuriken. Shuriken. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. That's why. This is why I'm not a translator for the game because my pronunciation of shit in the game is beyond terrible. Right, um. Burn Brush Staff's not great. What the hell is that? Oh, that's the, uh. I can use this with the priest, can't I? Yeah. See, so, yeah, I remember you having that equipped before, although that's better now, so. Um. We can also give it a fair as part of his equipment thing, which is what we're gonna do as one of his missions. I know we haven't met Pharaoh yet, but that's what we're going to do when we do. Who, for the rest of this game, I believe I've called Anton's brother because I can't remember his bloody name. His name's Pharaoh. Beckon Stone is, um, oh yeah. It's an age magical item used to summon creatures, apparently. I thought I used it to open the door, but I generally thought that was the key for the door, and it might be, but I can't. With this description, I don't remember now. Yeah, I'm not risking it. We're divining the bloody trap. Yes. I'm not setting off another man anti magic trap. I've got to camp and get on my bus back yet. It feels bad not to have anything on. You know, at the very least I usually got light on. Really? Can't see a bloody thing. <sighs> What's Did I do something wrong there? Was I not paying attention? I clicked the wrong box or something. I'm gonna have a bath. Oh, it won't let me. So I can walk up here, but there's absolutely no reason to walk up here. Oh, my inner balance. Well, that sucks. Right, right, much better. All right, well, um, since this is the chaos room, I don't want us to go horribly wrong. We're gonna do it like mm, this. Bellowed. Knock knock. Oh, all right. Well, you try that rank. Probably not gonna work. New. Not not skill 100 percent. Still trip the chaos trap though. Ooh. Have I never got that item before? Well that's handy with T Tink then. That'll solve that taking one spot over the other thing we did at the last level up. First thing first, Tinkton. Find this book of dehydration. Or dis desiccation or whatever the hell it's called. Well one called Book of Dehydrate, I don't know, but Desecration. Fine. And then Saber. Look at all at you. Look at these high and kind does. High king does. What about the second time? 
This is, that's 10 plus 10, 10. That's 12 plus 5. We'll take the 12 plus 5, thanks. I'm sure that's probably better for someone in my team, though. Not you, because you're a ninja. You couldn't be shit. Uh, no, because you're wearing heavy stuff. You're wearing heavy stuff. Um, yeah, that's going to be greatly heavier than that, though, isn't it? So, no, that's not. I prefer him to have a bit of speed. Maybe, because... Although, the Bard has a pretty good set of equipment. He also does get hit occasionally. Hmm. Maybe. Well, we've got time before I sell it, so I'll check. I'll have a think about it. Right. Oh, yeah, I need to... Alright, well, let's go open that other, no doubt, trap chest. It's going to summon an elemental or some shit to kill me. Let's open this. It's trapped. Yep, and we're taking no risks at all. We're going to divine trap it. And then we're gonna knock knock it. I, I doubt that has any effect on each other, but I weren't taking a risk. And then we still set it off anyway. Five dexterity. It's a weird thing to have on gloves, although it'd be really useful for that lord. Helm insight, ten less ionics. This is almost de oh no. I could say that's almost definitely cast. The helmets are a pain in the ass. Ten psionics is a mind read plus four on it. Not powerful. Three hour class, not bad. Depends who can use it really. It's really nice equipment in here though. You bellowed. You'll notice for the rest of the game I paid no attention at all to the equipment in the bloody game. Um so that has like six armor class on it, so no. That has three in the uh immunity to that. So although I could equip that, we need the immunity. And yeah, you're wearing a really shit helmet though, aren't you? You've just got a normal male coif on. Um yeah, well, <laughs> how badly equips the Lord? That's because he's not a primary party member of my team, is he? So I don't give a crap about his stuff. Alright, um. Do I have a helmet that would be useful to you? Not really. I have these helmet coifs down here, but these are medium weight armors. They have two sets of mana gloves. Oh, cool. Uh. Do we have any gloves you can wear? No, because yours is ninja specific, and Ninjas and fairies are a pain in the ass for that. I ain't that concerned about the equipment. He's better equipped than he was. We need the camp. Um, safe place to camp. Safe place to camp. Huh? More beasts. Oh, hello. This train will be over real soon. This must be the one we went away earlier. Got better. Taken care of. Oh no, not make wounds. This is 17 damage, I'm pretty impressed with that. I thought they were like pretty good fucking divine resistance at least by now. My body is injured, but my mind remains clear. Taken care of. There you go guys, beat the crap out of her. I know we're not buffed. So I won't expect flawlessness. But yeah, no penetration, people are missing more attacks and stuff. It's definitely worth having your buffs off. <laughs> that'd be cool if TB had killed all the flame stuff the first turn of giving it. I think that'd be the first melee kill of the entire game. Oh, apparently didn't pick the sword up. There we go. Right. Uh, was there anything else to do down here before I backtrack? I can't remember. What did we get off the woman? Did we get something on. Yeah, we got the beckoning stone, didn't we? Right, yeah. Okay. So now we've got a. Uh... That's a relief. Right. Um, much better. You, you don't look very much like a rep to be honest, love. The illness has passed. I'm assuming that's human-y feet. Right, good to hear, good to hear. Just waiting for the last ones. We can pick up the pace, boss. That annoying sickness is behind me now. Uh, I do really want to camp, though. Alright, we're going to camp here, which might be a bad idea, but I need to camp somewhere. So I need to rebuff. And although I could do that on that mana, I'd have, like, no mana left afterwards. Hello, Montington. There we go. What a relief! Right. 
listening. We'll use the hybrids this time. Any better skill level we can get would be nice. Although obviously they don't have power cast and stuff, so it doesn't last as long as the others might. What is it? I could just return to someone's portal, can I? I set one out. I remember this map now. My brain's recovered and I seem to remember where things are. But I set someone's portal at the uh Thank you. At the two portals. It sounds mental if you know you didn't see what that part. I don't remember whose portal it was, so having that information is not useful to me or you. I don't know, I could randomly spam people's portal until I find which one it was, but then I'm going to use loads of man up. Tragedy. I know it's not Tinkton's, because I would leave his where it was. Leave his in Martin's Bluff for the teleport abilities. Portal migration, after all, is very useful. Uh. I sense movement. Well, that's a lot of damn Rapex. I don't need to go down there, though, do I? Pretty sure I don't. I'm pretty sure I go back in here and then use the other portal. Well, I'm doing that. Do you know how much I was expecting there to be a big group of precessors then? Uh, oh yeah, there's a friendly geezer back there, isn't there? Um, I don't have the staff of Asta. What was I supposed to get the staff? I can't remember. Well, that portal opens that. Uh, the beckoning stone opens that, if I remember rightly. I'll look up here quickly. Got to explore. Someone to fight. Let yeah, someone to fight. Let's go get him. I'm sure there's more enemies up there, but I'm not going to stand here and let pepper me with arrows, so we'll go find out. Just to be safe though, we're going to cast enemy shield right then. and soul shield. Because if there are more enemies up there and I'm about to run into them, I would prefer to be a bit more defensive. I know on the map it doesn't show them. Because there could very well be absolutely nothing up there. <laughs> Funny, because two minutes ago I was saying I remember the map. What I actually meant was the other day when I got, I was like, oh, I think I can run across this lava. Let's give it a try. That's because you can go across there. It's just I forgot you needed to break the support structure. And then when it came to that bit, I was like, uh, what have I got to do now? And then I, I remembered. It's high time someone healed me. Which feels like an episode of Doctor Who. And then I remembered. Gotcha. And then I forgot. Oh, I wish I could remember what episode that was now, because I'm going to have to watch it. When I'm finished this, I'll have to watch it, otherwise it'll be stuck in my head. <laughs> Crazy naked rap hex people, why haven't you got armor on? You're ripped, though. you got all of that action man thing going on, where your legs don't look like they're attached to your body. Which I suppose in a game from the early 90s is fine. In a music video from... D'Angelo, I think his name was, it looked really weird. But that's because he was a human being with that sort of body. And I'm sure it's very attractive. Doesn't look like a human being, but I'm sure it's very attractive. Alright, you use a mender just to make sure it's alright. I would set up spells, because, you know, it'd be faster than hitting them and it would just melee. But the melee is pretty quick. The actual, although it'd be faster in rounds, I think the actual time it takes for me to select the spells actually makes it faster just to let him hit him. In like a, this sort of fight, obviously, it was a big group and spells all the way. You suck. I'm standing in front of you. You could just jab me with the arrow. How did you miss? Oh yeah, got a hex on that. 
that pole arm she's using does a badass amount of damage, like 40 plus damage a hit. They should always kill the archers to get the free arrows. But yeah, um, that's the courtyard. So we're not going in there yet, because, you know, it's a thing we're not doing yet. We're still clearing out this bloody massive, massive area. Well, it definitely looks like the shape of that beckoning stone I picked up. Oh, is this the boss room? Yeah! We've got to fight El Dorado, haven't we? Who, I don't remember what he does, but he's got beastie special defense, so we're going to go um, elemental defense. And he's casting stuff out, so we're going to go element shield, out. We're going to go soul shield. We're going to summon some bodyguards, because that's how I like to roll. Summon elemental. Haste, obviously. Taken care of. Can you summon elementals, Ranger? Yes, you can. Summon an elemental. Okay. Someone needs to cast bless, so you might as well do it. Gotcha. What have you guys got? Oh, you got magic screen, soul shield, and stuff. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, you cast guardian angel on yourself. Check. I didn't sort the formation out. I forgot. Still haven't really done that. All right. Well, since we're not moving forward just yet, you cast Razor Clock on Samurai. We're gonna walk up in a minute and just melee his face because he got like 800 health. Just want to be buffed first. No, because that's the wrong spell. I saw the wider element and went, yeah, that's probably it. Right then. Uh, you heal people, Take please, TP. Uh, you already summoned your elemental, so um, that's all you get to do, really. Yeah, that's all you get to do, Saber. Alright. Uh, so yeah, so as soon as Tintin's fired is, we move up. Oh, no. Do me a favour and cast haste again though, because I want to give haste to all these, to all these elementals. Anyway. Oh, that'll do then. Because you know, we've got a decent, decent amount of bodyguards. Probably stand here and they'd do all the work for me, to be honest. take forever to kill him with twos and what fives and stuff. Ooh. That'd have hurt a lot more if I didn't have a heal cue straight up afterwards. Oh, don't stand right there. That's where I was going to go. I didn't think about that. I should have moved up first. Alright, so if I can't get close enough, then we will have to let the enemy also kill him. That's right, if they're only in for 26, I ain't going to wait for that much. Although I have much higher speed, so I can hit several times. Well, they're just free haste, so they should be pretty useful. <laughs> I just love the fact that I'm a gargoyle, I'm going to come down from up here and beat you up, and I'm like, yeah, I'll summon an army of elementals. I'll summon a messenger, uh, well... More or less a god from each class of magic just to beat the crap out of you. See how well you hold up. Oh, you. I'm an idiot. I didn't mean to click that. I was waiting for it, and for some reason the pop up made my like, reflex click. So we're going to have to waste another time moving now. So we've got him under control though. Scary with element shield on. Or soul shield. What was that magic missiles? If magic missiles are soul shield, it was someone else's element shield. Divine or mental soul. Everything else element. Well, that's it, turn your back on the elements, because you know that's that's a good way to deal with elementals. Turn turn away and look up look at look at me instead. 
Although, yeah, probably don't want to turn you back on the saber on that because they'll mess you up. I'm not going to waste spells on him because he's got like 150, 200 resistance on his class, so it's better just to let him hit him. Got some cool gloves, though, hasn't he? Got the Wolverine like that. Maybe he just comes out of his knuckles. Pretty cool. Unfortunately, as Wolverine would say, second best don't cut it, bud. Although he's saying a much more manly, gravelly tone, obviously. And he's unconscious. Well, well he's dead. Okay, yeah, so the Lord and that are terrible for damage, but everyone else can't miss. Well, they can miss, but they're bloody unlikely to when he's unconscious. So we're just going to beat the crap out of him. Is he not unconscious? I can't see his stats, so yeah, win. He's still unconscious. He's got a cool white glowy thing coming up around him. This is enemy explode or something, I forgot. Because this could end badly. Dude, you have so much health. And 3,000 gold apparently. Not sure why the gargoyle had 3.5 grand, but yeah. Gold nuggets? Yeah. They bullets. We've got bullets called gold nuggets. Eat the 20 damage. Well, we should be able to make them out of gold, right? I've got 300 grand. Because they're pretty damn good for bullets. Obviously, we're going to go down here. Oh, I know what's down here. So it's not the fight, though, is it? It's just the conversation, I believe. Can we open these? No, we can't open them. Rodan will do the talking for us. What on our sextus? Who dares intrude in my temple? A moment. You might do. Oh, yes. Indeed, you might. Oh, I can down, you're naked. I can't move the screen, so I'm partially naked. They're forcing me to look at it. I'll cover one up. It's the best I can do. Cover that one up. No, class is not big enough. That's it, you disappear. There we go. You know, I was just investigating the map next to so that was well definitely a bit too forward to my liking. It just took me out to loot a dungeon or something first. No. Can't remember if you have to pock her for, to, for the next bit to apply. I didn't kill the uh, fire giant, did I? Did I? I don't remember. Hang on, what have I got my inventory here? Do that. I got key items. Um, no, these are not key items. These are key items. No. I guess not, because I haven't got the. Um, Did I miss it? Is it possible to miss it? It might be. Did I have to walk down the other s mm. Well, yeah. So that's a whole thing I probably missed. Well, if I missed it, there was a quest I've missed, but never mind. We shall see. Oh, we're not going through there just yet. We're going to stop here. This seems like a decent place to wrap it up. Heal up. No one needs leveling because I did it at the beginning of the video. So, um, yeah, seems like a good place to wrap it up. Don't know how long I've been playing for, but yeah, these videos seem to flux too much to care now, so it's however long it has been. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you all next time, which for me will be about 20 seconds when I go through there. Stay lucky, people.